can't believe Spider-Man finally won. It ain't over till someone got him. Boss wants your head. You don't mess with the Kingpin and live. Bring a right now. Get down here. I'll teach you to respect. Keep him on the ground. We don't stand a chance.
can't believe Spider-Man finally won. It ain't over yet, though. No, I know. But I remember when he was a punk kid and the boss used to <laughs> his ass on the regular. I thought the boss killed him more than once. Maybe he did. Lenny says there's more than one Spider-Man. Fight your tongue. That's all we need. An army of Spider-Man. You guys are new here. So let me give you rule number one. You do not want to be late with the shipment. Ever. Boss runs a tight ship. He does not like screw-ups. We had this guy once. Dumb. He decided to stop off for a drink on the way to a delivery. That was his last delivery. You know what I mean? The boss is coming. We get paid well because we deliver. Every time, on time. Got it? Even the rats are staying away. Now I gotta pee. Who dies on Spider-Man? <sighs> you should've stayed in bed. How'd he do that? Get him! <laughs> Everyone feels great to have you back. 
So then, did you all hear about that Arasaka aircraft carrier docked in Night City called Kujira or The Whale? Apparently, the corp figured it wasn't safe in Japanese waters, afraid some local fishermen might harpoon it for scientific research. But honestly, it's quite the power move. Wonder what Militech will respond with. Maybe Myers will fly a rust bucket B-17 flying fortress over Arasaka HQ. Oh, man, that's... that is... insensitive. I am so sorry, where are my manners? President Myers, I mean, of course. <laughs> Gotta respect the office. Anywho... Caught something when I jagged into that corpo's biomon. Dunno, uh, neurovirus, sir. Need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling, my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Yeah, throw on some threads, meet me downstairs. Hello, hello. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me? Can you hear me now or no? Gina Jones here. If you're looking for work in Watson, give me a call. How'd you find me? How'd you even know my name? I know where to gather my intel. Could even call me a collector. Later, B. Soya Silva Machistador! An explosion! Or two. What do you say? How you like my new punching bag? Just gave me a next gen ass whooping. He did. Be curious to see how he handles the likes of me. <laughs> so, how about it?
Nah, not today. Thanks anyway. Whatever. I'll be. In response to increased gang activity, the mayor's office has raised the public threat level to red. Residents of Arroyo and Watson are advised not to leave their homes after dark and always ensure easy access to protective firearms. Schools and hospitals have been closed until further notice. Oh, it's time to hear me now. The Aratama Matsuri Festival is nearly upon us. Did you play? Did you did you play this on mouse or controller? Hey, wait, don't go. Multi-story dashi floats. The festival program will also include musical performances by Biwa virtuosos and theatrical performances in the No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation, and in an exciting development, even Hanako Arasaka has announced her participation in the dashi parade. From all of us at WNS News, we wish you a safe and fun month. Hour. <laughs> Sheesh, took you long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down, let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. I mentioned something about a surprise yesterday. Am I remembering right or just had a brain fart? Probably both. <laughs> this game looks good. You usually forget shit. But it just so happens, this game I looks think good. I might have bagged us a sweet ass J-O-B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little-known someone named Dexter Deschamps. Only the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat-ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold-plated cool. So what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but, uh... This whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. All right, let's hear what old Dex has to say. Set it up. Dex is up. a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong, don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is in a league of his own. You know what I'm saying? Not really, no. It's always the same story. You land on fresh turf, local fixer waves his dick around, but he's smiling, saying you'll be up to your neck in gigs and eddies. Still. Still, all you are is another name in their little black book. Nifty tool for getting them a fat slice of whatever half baked shit pie their client put on the table. Sure. You crack jokes over drinks, but in the end, it's biz. Gracias, Dios. Estoy lleno. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our uh, dust up with the scabs. I'm fine. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. First stop. Ripper Duck and Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vic's anyhow. I got a date. Me and Miss D. You don't say. She's so sweet. 
really gets me, you know? me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. Yeah. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. There's weird people in this city, dude. Vector will see what you up? now. Hi. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. You look Vicky, surprise every old ripper. It's good to see you. Good to see you too, V. It's been a while. So what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neuro socket. Think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Old kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter to Sean? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. Hmm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Hey, what's this dude gonna do to me, dude? He's gonna jack me up or what? Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Yeah, eyeball. Now jack in. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now? I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing oh. tops that on the market. Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. You peruse and choose while I scan. Let's see what's going on inside.
Mark I, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Yeah, cut my hand out, dude. Feel anything? Play by play, though? Really, Doc? Makes you sound like a dentist. Always going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? Oh, boy. Give me an eyeball, I think. Okay, let's test this. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Yay. Time for the scanner. It might take you a few seconds to adjust. But first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. Scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any ne'er-do-wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. It ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new sight. Oh, boy. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. That looks sick. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stem. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. <laughs> Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from.
heart chakra looks a little out of whack, babe. I can release it for you, but you'd have to watch out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds. V, yo, listen up. I talked to Dex while you were in with the doc. He's waiting in his ride for you. Ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to Gramsci Burgers. Okay, do my Gramsci best to talk burgers? us up. Burgers? V, listen, I've got this delicate matter. That's why I called you. The number of cyber psycho attacks in this city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tack hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope that's all clear. Hmm. Yo, Mr. V. Yo, yo. A pleasure. What up? Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. <laughs> Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Because I already Corps don't deserve fun. special treatment. Shit, you, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Sir. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, a rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Cause if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat-out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say went, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate, one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skidding around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter, so she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Client, what's her thing? 
Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End of convo. <laughs> anyway, our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. One more thing, Mr. V. Fixed for the chance. Quiet life or a blaze of glory? Hmm? Later now. Later, player. Dexter, talk to Dex. Yeah, <laughs> Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nine, yeah. Clint to want to check our pro cred, but to me it feels more like he tangled us up with Maelstrom and Militech. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clepped it, then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the Gangoons had a switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick. Hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent, too, but... I don't know how much help she stands to be. Ha. <laughs> no. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. They must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? I say we knock on Maelstrom's door first. Pound, actually. What I lay. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. Put my nose to the ground. Sleep around. Hasta luego. Poor fin. Let me hear what you squared away. So Dex already paid the Maelstromers for the Corpo bot. Thing is, can't be sure the Gangoons are still willing to hand it over. He paid up front? Híjole. Well, whatever. Let's go get this tech. You scheme yet? You got a plan? That shit can go smoothly. This is Maelstrom. Gang world ain't too complicated. Might's right, the strong survive. 
Either you fuck others, or you get fucked. Oh, boy. So, into the Borg Beast Den. Let's go see these bastards. All right, let's knock on their door. See if they even open up. I hate these Borg fuckers. It had to be them. Just a gang like any other, right? I'll take the Valentinos. They follow God and the Santa Madre. Honor means something to them. You know what they want, how they get it, and what pisses them the fuck off. With Maelstrom, you just never know. You got a machete on his bag, dude. Go on, let them know we're here. V, what you waiting for? Talk to Royce. Dex sent us. Main room. We've been waiting. Uh, cozy place. Could use a few plants, though. Oh, yeah. They look damn well prepared. Don't think I've ever seen security like this in the Chow factory. Uh, gear from the Jack Convoy. Gotta be. Must have been all over it like maggots on dead meat. Get in the elevator! Fucking sheep! You hear about their boss, Royce? Dex mentioned it. Called him special. All right, you chill, V. Remember, we're on their turf. So what do you want? You got a bot. Model MT0D12. Called the Flathead. And? The hell you care? Guy I represent already paid brick for it. I'm just here for the pickup. I can talk direct to Royce if necessary. Nah, you talk to me. Name's Tum Tum. Now couch, planet. Ah, uh, well, shit. Goes for you, too. I'll stand. This so fucking hard? Fucking ass on the fucking couch! Make me. Thought you'd never ask. Sit your ass down for a planet bullet in your skull. Jack, sit down. This ain't gonna end well, but... Shit. Well, all right. Come on. Got lighten up. Take a hit. Thanks, I'm good. <sighs> Whatever you say, straight-edged princess. Here we go. A flathead. Model MT-0-D12. Militech's not gonna come looking for it? Fuck them. They can hop around and try. We'll remove the serial number and lift it access locks using our soft. Once it's yours, it's yours. Need to see it. Suit yourself. Fucking tricked out this thing. Dynamic thermal optic camo armor. Full cognitive immersion with a Raven controller. Pimped out prototype actuators made of titanium vanadium Kevlar composite. And watch this! Fully integrated Link 2, 
to when the spider starts crawling up walls dangling from ceilings. Mm hmm Could lose your lunch. So what you think? Yep, we'll take it. Three. Sure. Yeah. Let's see a cred. Brick got it. It's all paid up. Brick got it. <sighs> I don't see any fucking brick around here, do you? I'm talking! Come on. Can't expect me to pay for this thing twice. And who the fuck are you to say what can and can't be? You'll pay twice because I say you'll pay twice. All right. You want the flathead? I better see some eddies. Seeing as you already got the eddies for it, you ought to offer us a discount. A big one. A discount? Fuck. You know, you never did say who sent you. Never did say who you're working for. Dexter Deshawn. That's who. Dexter Deshawn. The lord ass who punching animal fucked half a Pacifica? I mean, he ain't dead? No. He's alive, well, and kicking. And he sends his regards. So you're gonna consider my offer now? the gear. Bottom control side. Quick! Gotta find a way out of here. Got the set. Bot and controller. Let's go. Quicker the better. Let's get out of here. I'm dying for some fresh air. Production line. Plus, I thought you loved me. Really, no other way.
fire! Stay with me! Got him! Going down! Oh, come on, man. What is going on? Alright. That's enough for the the test stream.